When a pack of wild dogs attacked a man in Maricopa, he fought back with his handgun. And shockingly, this isn't the first time either. Neighbors tell us wild dogs have taken over their community. ABC 15's Steve Cooge went to South Maricopa to see just how bad it's gotten. Surrounded by a pack of wild dogs, it was a frightening situation some people may not have made it out of alive. She jumped in the middle of all nine of them to save me. Dennis Johnson says he owes his life to his border collie, Baby. When a group of Pitbull and Rottweiler mixes came at him, she bought him some crucial time to grab a gun inside of his home. Then they all turned on me. So I just started shooting. At that time, I, had, I, had, I didn't have my pistol out. I had my rifle, a 22, and I just started shooting. I, ki I killed one and injured two. Baby was hurt badly. She's got 30 stitches, laceration from here to here on the top side, and then it goes around on the inside. Throughout this area, you can see signs of these wild animals. I mean, just take a look right here in front of me. These are tracks, footprints of at least a dozen different dogs. Over the past few years, Johnson has caught nearly 60 of the wild dogs, but lately, he says they've gotten even more aggressive. They're packing up and attacking all of our animals. Johnson, like some of his neighbors, carries a gun on his side whenever he goes out. Now, he's worried about how he and his wife will pay for the expensive surgery baby could need to survive. Survive. They said it was going to be between five and eight thousand dollars, and we can't afford that. In Maricopa, I'm Steve Couge, ABC 15 News. County Animal Control has set up traps to catch the dogs, and if you want to help Johnson and his dog, Baby, you can learn how under the story on our website, abc15.com.